Let's look at the Monticello browser here for a second. We'll go to the JSON repository, which we've already got. We open it up. We get that smaller window, which shows us the actual uh, projects and versions. So that's one way of getting stuff into our image using this GUI. Yeah, there are the versions. And if we hit load there, we know it'll load in. But we can do this programmatically um, without using this GUI. It's sort of quicker and faster if you already know what you're looking for. You type in installer and SS for a squeak source. That's the repository. Then we need to add the name of the directory, which is JSON. So we type in project colon string JSON. Then we have to choose um, which of the two projects are there, Delta string, Streams Storing or JSON. We're going to choose JSON. So we need to add install colon JSON. And I forgot to put a semicolon between the two of them, so I'll do that now. So I can just highlight that and do it. It'll take the most recent version. That's the one at the top. So we don't have to put that in. It's a default. So we highlight that, do it. It loads JSON in. Go to the bottom and see there are the classes classes which we just loaded in. So you can build, you know, that's just a simple example um, of how to do how to load things programmatically without using Monticello.